These are Malash's guardians. I need you to eliminate them before I proceed. If it must be done... Wait, what is that strange fog? Tarazine. It flows in cycles from the chasms of slain, bringing us closer to the void. Amon's forces will be able to manifest until the flow subsides. They do not possess their full power here, yet they will strike at your base ruthlessly. I thought you promised an assured victory, Alarak. You enjoy a challenge, do you not? Very well. My forces will pursue the Guardians while it is clear. When the Terrazine flows, we must endure the onslaught. The Terrazine will rise shortly, my warriors. Be vigilant. Void rays can now be warped in at our Stargate. They are ideal for intercepting foes in the battle ahead. Well done, Faye Smith. We will make good use of them. Full power. Kas Arashar. It shall be done. Under cool the rock. Calibrating void lenses. Annihilation convincing. The veil between this world and the void is lifting. Amon's forces will arrive soon. This warrior, you have not God. enough minerals. over the shrines. Kill them slowly and painfully. My people will fight with honor, even when we are fighting for you. But first, we must establish our defenses. Gus, our show. Calibrate boy lenses. Under Warrior awakens. I was able to scan the Taldarine motherships in this region. They are carrying shipments of Solarite. I don't think Alarak would mind if we liberated them. This vessel shall avenge. It could die. Prism 
Diplomatic Corps online. Upgrade complete. Approach the void. Ready your warriors. You have not enough minerals. Ships are heading towards our Nexus Hierarch. Bring them down! Annihilation commencing. Systems at full. Processed. 
Annihilation commencing. We face the enemy. Cast our show. We face the enemy. coming after you. You require more Vespine gas. Prismatic core online. This vessel is down. Chance to light the light. Crystals charged. Cas Arasha. Shudder to think of what they were planning to do with it. Annihilation commencing. Amon 
Ren's forces coming after you. Annihilation commencing. It will die. Base is under attack. Our pylon is under attack. And a clearing rock. Annihilation commencing. is under attack. Calibrate more. This vessel shall. Construct additional pylons. Prismatic core unlocked. <laughs> Malash, of course. We serve the will of the High Lord. Enemy ships have set a course for our Nexus. Calibrating boy lenses. Shall be done. Annihilation commences. We face the enemy. Base is under attack. We face the enemy. It shall be done. Zaknaku Afa Paradakural. Cast our shot. Mineral field depleted. Under cool rock. Calibrating for mineral field. Artanis. I only hope that is true. It 
shall be done. Channel the light of I. Mineral field depleted. Annihilation commencing. Annihilation commencing. At daybreak, you shall have your challenge. I am going to make this clear. The Templar are not a weapon you can wield as you wish. We are not here to slay your enemies under false pretenses. Deceive me again, and this alliance of ours comes to an end. Slaying Malash's guardians fulfilled more than one purpose. Once the High Lord lies dead at my feet, none will challenge my rule. After all these years, my victory is nearly at hand. I feel his concern on Tannis. He knows that I'm coming for him. Malash? No. Amon. Through the breath of creation, I peer beyond the veil. Oh, yes, I feel his rage washing over me. He knows I no longer fear him. He knows that the Talgarim have no color for him to control. I will turn the Chosen against him. Do not assume you are already victorious, Alarak. Do not let the Terrazine cloud your judgment. You have a battle to win first. The battle is already won. In my mind's eye, 
I have delivered the killing blow in a thousand ways. From my experience, overconfidence is your opponent's greatest ally. Do not let yours aid Malash. Spoken as one who welcomes defeat. Hierarch, one of our combat units can be assigned a new faction through the console in the War Council. Malash has proven himself to be a dangerous leader. Indeed. That's why my victory shall be the sweetest of ecstasy. Has he defeated many in this right? Countless. He ascended the chain with brutal wrath, plowing through all who opposed him. It's as if he were blessed by the Dark God. They called him the Blade of Amon. And still he was challenged? It is our way. He defeated each with lingering cruelty. Malash revels in bringing his challengers to the edge of death and tormenting them for a time after. That does not comfort me, Alarak. Comfort is a myth. Given to younglings until they are ready for the trials and pain that is true existence. Leave me. It is time to make preparation. This chain of ascension is a despicable practice. It is how the Kalai once thought of the Nerezim's Shadow Walk. There is no comparison. Our society was not founded upon... Their culture is one unyielding hierarchy, servant to master, a constant reinforcement of their bondage to Amon. But they have been lied to, Matriarch. And how could this change if it is all they have ever known? Our people once only knew hatred of one another. Suspicion. Yes. We viewed your practices as barbaric, and you viewed ours as cruel. It is the same with the Tal'Darim, with the destruction of Amon, and the revelation of his betrayal. I expect their entire society to seek out who they truly are, and what they wish to be. Ah, good. Hi. Kerax, the Keystone, it's reacting. To void energies upon the planet's surface, most likely. I've seen this before on Ulnar. This Terezine must be directly linked to the Void. The Tal'Darim call it the Breath of Creation. They believe imbibing it allows them to speak directly to Amon. A far-fetched claim, yet I cannot deny its plausibility. The substance's properties appear to be foreign to our universe. Perhaps this is why it is so holy to them. They seek out planets rich in Terezine, and turn them into temples to their god. Our coming here may be a blessing to us. If the Keystone reacts to Terezine like it does with Void Energy, I may be able to use it to stress the artifact, determine its limits. Perhaps fate has not abandoned us completely. We must have faith. I prefer results, Hierarch. Amon is powerful in measures that eclipse even the Queen of Blades. There is no room for uncertainty. 